Hello and welcome back to my channel, or well, welcome to my channel if you are a new viewer. I'm going to show you how to learn the Lemurian Axe today. I've popped all my stuff in the box because I don't need none of that. I'll go over to my map room. This is very applicable if you already have the obelisk learnt, otherwise we'll be running down there. But because I already have it unlocked, I'll teleport to the jungle. Oh, it's a baby cat. After that getting distracted. I like to run down this way, avoid kitties and the hard to get down to a long way. Uh, ah. You can continue running down the spiral as well if I just jump. Now there are a few monkeys in the decent XP if you are not level 55 yet for unlocking star metal, because that's the only real requirement. Being level 60 does help, so you can make the weapon handles, for sure, but um, you can also find them in boxes around the map. You can check out my other videos coming up or already out, depending. Time for any of you monkeys. Ah! Take a sip of water along the way. As you can see, it's pretty easy to get to here with, I think. I was going to potentially fight the Witch Queen too, but I'll do that in another little video, as these are my quick tips and how-to guides. Touch that if you haven't, and then touch the butt. The little oil gives you a recipe. I like to get all the recipes, because you never know. Run up this way. I'm hoping I'm going to be able to click the bit I need. The axe. You can also kill him and get some pearls, um, which is, yeah, that's basically it. The Lemurian axe is one of the best axes. It comes with already armor pen on it. It's fairly cheap to make with only star metal. Um, yeah, it's one of my favorite axes for sure. Now I'm level 60. I thought I'd um, learn it and show you all how to learn it as well. Get a story. The Watcher Above. Be vigilant. The captain below, be ready. The redeemer will tear the veil of time asunder and escape their prison. When they come, blood will flow. When they come, blood will flow. <laughs> well, might as well let him kill me now. And if you do die, you get to respawn in the sunken city. It's not too hard to get your stuff. I'm going to respawn in my bed. I hope you all enjoyed and found this quick little tips helpful. Uh, please do leave a comment for other ones you'd like to see in the future as well. I've got a whole bunch planned, some farming ones, a bunch of how-tos. And of course, my Let's Play is still going. It's exciting. If you haven't checked it out, please do. Until next time, have an excellent day, evening, night, or whatever it may be, wherever you may be. Have a good one.